lucky. Oh, there's a weird bug here. I just noticed. Look at that. I don't know, it's some kind of a slug. Do you see it? Okay, back to the vlog. So there's Kaylee here. We're going to install these um, pan pans to help air out the, the cabin. So first step is to paint them because they came white. We want them to be a brown wood color. Okay, there it is. Waiting to dry and then we'll put them up. Put them up, put them up, put them up. Okay, finally got this uh, thing hanging after a long process of stuff. So we'll see, I have to still wire it in and figure out uh, how to get the switch and everything to work. So we'll see. There it is. Got both fans running. Now a good, good ventilation. Got some decent amount of power, it's drying. Okay, so now we're blending the pineapple to juice it in a cheap blender. Yeah, that's going. So now the blender finished blending. It looks cool how white it is. And then we got the nut milk bag with the pitcher. bits and then the juice comes out you can see here the juice being squeezed and that's a nice easy way to make juice and that's cheap enough also because most people already have blenders so all you really need to buy is this nut milk bath which is less than 10 bucks usually If you want a link to the uh, buying it, I can include that in the description. <laughs> okay. Yes. So the juice we got from one medium-sized pineapple there is about one liter. Try to see here. And yeah, the pulp is quite dry. So here where we do the composting. Oh, it's hardly even coming out, it's so dry. I guess if you wanted, you could dehydrate this into cookies or something. You want to show something? Yeah. yeah, you can see. Pretty good. And then we compost this and grow more fruits. And also the power that we have here is all from solar. So we're connected there to the batteries and the charge controllers. And there's a solar panel set up on top of the kitchen there. Off-grid living. <laughs> Don't let me know. Okay. And then this is the system we have, the batteries, charge controllers. And okay, so here's my Suriname cherry. Looks like it's got some red fruit on there. It just fell somewhere when it's close to being ripe. Sapote and banana smoothie. Looks like chocolate pudding. Black sapote banana smoothie. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Very nice. So this is the black sapote from the land and bananas that are from the land. Chili from the land. Oh. <laughs> 